In a recent interview with Radio Television du Burkina, RTB, Burkina Faso's transitional president, Captain Ibrahim Traoré, discussed the current state of affairs in the country and its relationship with France. Captain Traoré clarified that Burkina Faso does not view the French people as enemies, but rather takes issue with certain policies enacted by the French government in Africa. He emphasized that so long as a nation does not adopt an imperialistic approach, there should be no issues between the two countries. During an interview that was recorded on August 31st, Captain Traoré stressed the importance of cultivating a relationship between Burkina Faso and France that is founded upon mutual respect and equality. He advocated for a thorough re-evaluation of the cooperation that exists between the two nations, though he refrained from specifically naming France. Captain Traoré further expressed his concerns regarding the historical impact of France on African countries, alleging that they have meddled in the affairs of these nations by appointing leaders and interfering with their sovereignty. Captain Traoré highlighted that Burkina Faso has signed numerous agreements that have hindered its development. He expressed his concern about the impact of these agreements on the country's progress. While he did not explicitly name any other imperialist states apart from France, he acknowledged that there are other nations with similar ambitions. The transitional president also questioned the effectiveness of French troops in Burkina Faso's fight against jihadist groups. In January, he had already called for their departure. Since then, Burkina Faso has sought new partnerships and cooperation. Captain Traoré mentioned that they now have support from other unnamed countries, which have provided assistance in terms of equipment and other resources. Burkina Faso's Minister of Foreign Affairs, Olivia Rowamba, expressed the country's interest in strengthening bilateral cooperation with Iran during her recent visit to Tehran. This visit aimed to explore opportunities for collaboration with Iran in various fields. Furthermore, Burkina Faso has engaged in discussions with the Russian delegation regarding development and military cooperation. Captain Traoré himself visited St. Petersburg in July to attend the Russia-Africa summit, indicating the country's efforts to diversify its international partnerships. During a recent interview, Captain Ibrahim Traoré, the transitional president of Burkina Faso, reaffirmed his country's unwavering support for Niger in the wake of a coup d'etat that occurred on July 26th. The two nations share a common concern regarding the Three Borders region, which they both share with Mali. This area is considered a stronghold for jihadist groups, making collaboration and cooperation between Burkina Faso and Niger crucial in addressing security challenges in the region. Captain Traoré's interview also shed light on Burkina Faso's evolving foreign relations and its desire to forge new partnerships while re-evaluating its existing cooperation. The transitional president emphasized the importance of equality and mutual respect in international relations, expressing his country's determination to pursue its own path of development beyond the influence of imperialist forces. This commitment to independence and self-determination is a key element of Burkina Faso's foreign policy, which seeks to promote peace, stability, and prosperity in the region through peaceful means.